Okay guys, so before this tutorial starts, I want you to check out RaymondDigital.com. It's basically a website where you can get like really awesome high quality intro templates that are really easy to edit. All the info is in the description down below. What's happening guys, my name is Alex and welcome to a new Sony Vegas tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to fix shaky footage. So let's say I'm going to turn on my GoPro right now. So as you guys can see right there, my GoPro is now running and I'm going to film myself while making this video, vlogging style. So as you guys can see on the GoPro camera right there, uh, this this footage can be like really shaky. Like if I do this with my hand, I'm going to try to keep it as still as possible though. But still guys, you know, I'm going to show you guys how to fix that because there are a lot of options you can actually, you know, apply and let's, you know, a, a GoPro a GoPro is a little bit different, you know, than actually a, a cell phone because a GoPro is like so small and it catches every movement. So I'm going to try to show you guys how to, you know, stabilize this shaky footage. So I would say let's jump straight into the actual video. Alright guys, so as you guys can see I am on Sony Vegas and right now I'm going to show you guys how to stabilize this clip. So this is the clip, you know, from the GoPro that I, that I recorded like, you know, in the intro that you guys saw. Okay, so as you guys can see on the edges, it's so like shaking like right here. GoPro camera right there. Um, this Look right this there. This can be like really shaky. Like if I do this with my hand, I'm going to try to keep it. It's just it's shaking so fast, and I'm going to show you guys how to um, stabilize. It's really simple. So the first thing that you want to do, is just you know, make this you know the footage like stabilized a bit more. It's really simple though. You just want to go to the video effects tab right there, and you want to pick the guy stabilize. And then you have four presets, as you can see where I am. Um, but this one, as you can see, that one is the heavy stabilization. You want to pick that one. So you just want to drag that on top of your track. And as you guys can see, you don't need to mess around with markers because this is already a preset for you. So this is just a heavy stabilizer and that is how you stabilize the video. But if you want to say I want to stabilize it way more, you can apply way more stabilizers to it. You can you can add like 10 if to it, you can add like 15, 20. It, it, it all that depends on, you know, like when you're happy with it. It doesn't really matter how many times you apply it, though. But uh, it's like a perfect, it's like a, it's like a perfect preference. Like I want to apply it this much, and I'm happy enough with this. Like really shaky. Like if I do this with my hand, I'm going to try to keep it as still as possible, though. Still. As you guys can see, it's just way, way better. You know, the edges are just going smooth and not like shaky. So, so that looks pretty good, actually. You can also use like you can you can start off with a light one. Uh, with a weedy, with a medium one or like a or like the heavy one, but I would just like just go straight to the you know to the heavy one because you I think probably you need to you know you need to pick like five light ones to equal one like heavy one just to pick the heavy one straight away you know apply it as many times as you like until you're happy with it and that is basically how you stabilize a video you can choose um, you can also like you know fix it outside of you know Sony Vegas which you can you can use like I don't know I would say like like a, like, a, like a monopod or something that you can mount you know the, the GoPro on and then you, it's like a little bit more stabilized because you're holding a stick and not the actual camera because if, if when you hold the camera it's gonna catch every movement if you're gonna catch the stick you know or something else you can help you can hold it's going to be less shaky that is what I would recommend you can use a stabilizer for this or you can buy like a like a selfie stick I don't know something you can mount the GoPro on to hold that in your hand and like and to minimize you know the shakiness of the of the actual video so I would say that is what you can do just really simple guys how you can stabilize the footage so I would say that is the end of the video guys this how you stabilize footage is really really simple and like I said in the video the cell phone I would say like like this Samsung one not sponsored can be way different than the actual GoPro as you guys can see right there because the thing is GoPros are action cams and they are so small and the quality is so high like 4k it catches every single movement a phone is a little bit you know sturdy you can keep it in your hand and do not like have it like that much of a shake it's pretty decent to hold but the little camera you're holding it like this and every movement you you're going to see that so that's basically how you stabilize footage guys I just wanted to say you show you guys this like this like a really handy tool to stabilize actually any footage actually also not like something else but like not a GoPro Shaky footage in general, doesn't matter which camera, a Canon 600D, a GoPro, or Samsung, a potato, it doesn't matter. You do want to just stabilize this, you're good to go. So that's the video, guys. Thank you, guys. I don't know, guys. I showed you guys everything. So that is the video, guys. That is how you, you know, 
Stay blind, shaky for it. So, I want to thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for liking and commenting on this on this video. Make sure to check out my channel in about two hours from now because then I will be uploading a video how to edit a video and how to post it on your Instagram page. So, make sure to follow me also there on Instagram for you know uh, updates and news and all that kind of stuff. So, make sure to follow me on Instagram, everything in the description. Also, check out the video in two hours from now on this very channel how to edit a video for Instagram and how you put it on Instagram itself so you can actually make a video with Sony Vegas for Instagram. So, it's going to be really easy it's really fun and that is the video guys make sure to smash the like button down below for more videos and also the subscribe button down below so thank you guys and i'll catch you guys in about two hours okay so the first thing is that you don't want to do in your car playing around with your cell phone drop comments down below and i'll be more happy to make a video about it. my own clothing line through the description down below even if you're not a subscriber correctly and quickly twitter verification process you can find a link down below i'm done with this kind of shit opportunity is there as long as you guys keep watching my videos i will keep making them